Hall is one of Lancashire's supposedly most haunted houses. It is currently closed to the public, it has to be one of the most haunted houses in Lancashire if not in England. It is situated in Goosnig near Preston. The hall was built in 1260 by Adam de Singleton and originally called Singleton Hall. The Vikings settled around Goosnig and the wooden beams used in the hall come from Viking longboats. One of the priest holes wasn't discovered until 1970. The owner at the time saw smoke coming from the from the chapel ceiling. She summoned the fire brigade who discovered the smoke originated from the unknown chimney hide. Over the years lots of ghosts have been reported one of the ones mentioned is thought to be Lady Eleanor Singleton, who was deemed mad and kept in the priest's room until her death aged around 16 to 18 years. People often say the smell. Lavender associated with her. I would say that the most famous ghost is that of blessed John Wall who, during the 17th century, went to France and became a Franciscan priest. On a visit to England he was arrested and convicted. For being a Catholic, he was hung, drawn and quartered, his remains were buried in Worcester. During the 18th century, a group of nuns brought his head back to Chingle and buried it somewhere within its boundaries. Since then he has been seen walking the grounds and even allegedly photographed and it is said his spirit will finally rest when his head is discovered. Other ghosts have been reported over the years, some say they have sensed the odor of a dog, possibly an Afghan hound. They think this probably because Lady Eleanor de Singleton had that type of dog as a companion. Other people have reported a monk dressed in black and one dressed in brown. The monk dressed in brown could well be. Blessed John Wallace this is the color of robes he would have worn. As for the monk whose robes are black I guess we will never know.